Hello everyone and welcome to our I Pick My Butt video. More Archro today and in this video we're going to be talking about the best way to farm gear in version 3.8. Now if you saw my video the other day you do know now that they've changed the way the game is formatted and the second you click on that level the gear is already predetermined for you. Also we're now getting great drops, the green actual drops inside the game. There is no guarantee way to improve your chances of getting them or getting them at all. So just be happy when you get one they still are a nice surprise now i did try flying bullets today and surprisingly i did get six items out of it i did try it the other day too though and where it showed me getting six it did replace one of them on the end screen with it and i only did get five i confirmed this inside the screen where all your gear is and you'll get the little new tab next to it but either way flying bullets is still a great way to get gear inside the game for five energy now you can see here i am playing infinite adventures and this is sometimes overlooked but this is a great way to get bracelets lockets and i actually even got a spell book in this i think it's the first time i ever really paid attention i never really play this too much besides once a day but this is a great way to really focus on getting specific gear like bracelets and lockets and if you're lucky the hardest items to get inside the game are the spell books spell books are the hardest followed by weapons followed by armor and then you have lockets and bracelets and then last the easiest ones you always see a ton of are going to be your rings and pets and of course, the greatest part about playing Infinite Adventures is the end of season rewards. If you're able to make it to level 200 on it, well, that's going to be guaranteeing you four obsidian keys. And that's a huge bonus all on its own. Now, Mystery Mine, that's another one that's kind of a little bit iffy. You are going to get some jewels with it, but it seems like when I do play it, I tend to get some decent drops out of it. It seems like it takes more from my wishes, but for some reason, that's just the perception I get when I play it. So use this as your discretion here because for 10 energy, it doesn't really make sense sense if you are going for the gear but it is a good combination to go with other things now as far as the chapters themselves we're going to have quick raids and now we have chapters dropping four items and even some great items with it too so which one should you go for well i always say now with having the altar there i really recommend that you do those hero modes and there's plenty of sheets out there this is one right here i found online i did make videos back in the day little outdated but some great places to go for I'd really recommend choosing one with either a book or even a weapon, but just keep in mind the higher chapters you get up to, that's going to be where the more drops pop in. So in normal, just regular chapter raids, I think chapter 18 is going to be where you start getting those four items or the possibility of getting four items. But like I said, use it at your own discretion. I try to go for one of the higher up ones, but I still find myself quick writing chapter 15 or even chapter 12 a lot of the times just to get them out of the way. And it's kind of what I'm looking for at the moment moment as far as getting those four drops like i just said i believe it's 18 that you're going to get them normally i would suggest doing a wave board but it seems like a lot of people are having good luck with getting nice gear from chapter 21 actually it's pretty quick to go through if you're able to get up to that point if not i mean don't feel bad you'll get there eventually but this seems to be a good chapter that's dropping items right now but guys, this is what I have for you. If there's a good spot you're finding to farm in, post it down in the comments so everybody else can see. And if you are here watching the video, go down and look in those comments. Give people a thumbs up that are giving those good suggestions and give them a try. Other than that, don't forget, like, subscribe, and remember, I pick my butt.